Hub City, one man is keeping the 1800s alive and well. Joshua Robertson has been drawing attention on his unique bicycle, and now he's riding for a cause. Our Trey Howard has the details. For safety reasons, I do tend to stay on the trace uh, a lot more. I'll ride it through USM, uh, some of the downtown sections where it's not as much traffic. But yeah, for the most part, pretty much all over downtown Hattiesburg. If you are traveling the Hub City on any particular day at just the right time, you may spot Joshua Robertson riding his penny farthing. So I got this bike back in March. Um, I was looking for a good hobby last year, year before, got back into cycling. And uh, as with most things in my life, I like doing things the hard way, the old fashioned way. Old fashioned is the perfect description for Robertson, even more so in the winter months when he can be seen in full Victorian era wear. But no matter how he's dressed, Robertson and his penny farthing are used to turning heads. The smiles on their faces are absolutely amazing. Uh, it's definitely not something that, that, that people see. They'll stop on 4th Street to take pictures. Uh, runners and cyclists on the trace, they're always turning around. Hey, you mind stopping and grab a picture real quick? While he enjoys interacting with the community, he's also using his hobby in a different way. This September, Robertson will ride his penny farthing in the Great Cycling Challenge to help raise money for children's cancer research. Well, it's all another way to, to help out even a little bit with children's cancer. Uh, I, I jumped on it to sign up. This will be his second year participating, and he says he's looking to up the ante. I'm going to do, uh, do another 100 miles next month. Uh, I'm going to try to do four 20 mile, 25 mile days, and the uh, goal for this year is 5,000. Robertson says others are welcome to join with their own bikes. In Hattiesburg, Trey Howard, WDAM7, on your side. Well, for more information, follow the link at our website at WDAM.com.